Malone and Ricky Santana. That's right, Don Cox. My main concern is directed at Mike Miller. You think I forgot how you busted my head open and put me in the hospital for three days? Or how you stole the belt from me and Brady? Or the fact that you tried to end my career by throwing something in my face? Well, boy, that's right. I said, boy, let me tell you one thing. When it comes down to B-Day and me and you are standing eye to eye, you're going to have to answer to me. I made a lot of predictions, Don Toss, in the past, and I backed every one. I'm making one more, and it's to you, Miller, and that prediction is pain, baby. You're going to pay. He means it. Yeah, he definitely means it. For you people out there that aren't here right now, you're going to miss a lot of action not seeing the masked man, the assassin, take the belt once and for all for Rip Oliver. And I mean that. You ought to be here. As far as Ricky said about Mike Miller throwing stuff in his eyes, Rip Oliver, you did that with Coco, just about blinded the man. You guys, all the time you're trying to put people out of commission, throwing stuff in their eyes, putting thumbs in their eyes, hitting them with tire irons, trying to put bars over their head. Like I said last week, that ain't what a champion's all about. A champion's when he goes to the gym every day. And he pumps the iron and he eats what he's got to eat. Not when he gets a bat and goes in there and hides it and hits someone over the head. That's not a champion. He said, you got those things around your waist, Mike Miller and Abuda Dean. Rip Oliver, you do too. It's only a matter of time before all the belts come back. Abuda Dean, you come out here, you read your bones of Bernard's. It looks to me like you've got short change at the Colonel. Okay? Me and Mike Miller, me and Mike Miller, we try to put Ricky out of commission. Well... Like I said, it's only a matter of time. All right, Brady Boone, Ricky Santana. Our main event is next, right after this. <laughs> 